Okay, wheelbase, four by four. Some of the exterior upgrades include upgraded tires as well as a flatline van co roof rack and ladder on the other side of the van. Let's step inside and see what this guy looks like. So inside this van, we have a bench seat here. Uh, this has three point retractable seat belts and can be used as a dinette. Both of these seats can be completely swiveled around and we have a mount, uh, table mount here. So it just turns into a nice little area for four people. We can go ahead and fold this away and then I'll take you through the galley. So once you have your bench seat folded away, I'll take you through the galley area. So again, we have our lagoon mount table that can also be mounted on the exterior for a happy hour table or whatever you want to use it for. Then we have our walnut butcher block countertops, our 15 by 15 Ravati sink. We have a true induction single burner induction cooktop. Uh, and then just for a little bit of extra countertop space, we can throw that up and have more prep space. Some other features of this galley that I really love are just how versatile it is. So we also have all of our drawers here for storage, uh, all the way down here, even a spice rack. And then if you open this guy up, we have our slim gray water tank as well as a Dometic toilet that can just be taken out as soon as you get to camp and used wherever. Some design features before we move to the rear of this van, we have our gray upholstered Duramax panels. We have a painted ceiling. Uh, we have this really nice grippy floor. This is going to stand up to a lot of rugged gear, whatever you want to put in here. It's not going to scratch. Um, it's nice and grippy as well. And then lastly, we have our slab door cabinetry throughout. So this is all painted white. It all has the gas struts as well as um, RV latches so that nothing's going to go flying out while you're on your journey. So in the front of this van, we have a T vent window on the passenger side and an AMA half slide um, on the driver's side. So this is really nice. It just slides open, ton of visibility there. And then in the rear of the van, we have our CR Lawrence half slides um, just for additional airflow and just to get some more natural light in the van. So in the rear of the van, we can take a look. We have our queen size raised fixed bed in the back. Um, underneath that we have our garage area so you come on in we have our garage lighting just to light everything up when you're loading your gear you're not going to lose anything back here additionally we have our power cabinet on the driver's side here so we have a 200 amp hour lithium-ion battery bank in there 200 watt solar array and 2000 watt inverter also, um, this van is equipped with hot water and heat via a Rickson system. So for our exterior shower and for our sink up front, we're gonna have hot water, which is lovely. Um, moving over to the passenger side of the van, we have a 20 gallon fresh water tank. And this is also where we're gonna store that Rickson heater. Um, so that's all gonna live in there. Additionally, everything back here is this black hex ply. So again, that's gonna be really rugged and durable. To stand up to all of your gear. Last feature of this van that I love, we have our bike stand. So just a great place to work on your bike, fix a flat, and just get it ready to hit the trails. That wraps up this van tour. Be sure to follow us on Instagram, subscribe to our YouTube channels so that you never miss a van tour. Thanks for